Well, I guess I'll go ahead and end the day by starting the video with saying I hope everyone gets well fed and is happy and healthy and y'all have a good time and I hope everyone has a wonderful Thanksgiving and now you can watch the video. I don't know, what do we call this? Sticky countertop production? Something like that, I reckon. <clears throat> What's it gonna weigh? How long is it gonna take to cook? Uh, what we got? 22.71 pounds. That's gonna take a minute to cook, guys. Stick it in one of them. Are you having company? Did you guys get one of these big enough to put grandma in? We don't want anybody getting sick now, do we? Is that even going to fit in here? 8 to 24 pounds. We're 2 pounds shy of stuff in the bag. Did I rip it? I think I ripped that one. My bad. Yeah. I've had it literally two seconds and I've already tore it up. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and do this and move my phone because it's a sticky countertop production and I don't want to turn it into a bloody camera production. There's been more than a time or two where I have forgotten to pull that stuff out of there. Not this year, you sneaky little bird. Man, what is up with that light behind me? Watch, it's going to go off again here in a minute. It's one of them fancy LED bulbs. I found it in the garbage. I think I know why they threw it away now. Well, I got her loaded up. Do you think we should put some ropes over it? Man, ain't no wonder that thing weighed 300 pounds. I thought it was a little heavier than they usually are. <laughs> I guess from now on, we'll just extract the trinkets. But, um... There is a steel tank inside there. I don't think this one's going to be stainless, but... We'll at least take this shell off here and get paid for that. And that. And that's real stainless. Some kind of a garden hose. Morning. I think that means it's done. Happy Thanksgiving. Yes, I left something in it. It never fails. Every freaking time. All the stores might be closed, but here at Mr. Scrappity's House of Resale Horrors, we'll sell you a broke down snowblower on Thanksgiving Day. A little Thanksgiving Day scrapping? That way. Well, hopefully we don't just find this. Hopefully we find everything else. And the kitchen sink. But, hey, 
it's a start. Did you guys see me deadlift that dehumidifier into my wagon? <laughs> you gotta get on my diet. You need to try it. I don't know, maybe it'll be like yesterday. Maybe there'll be more out here than I figured. The JB weld that I put on the exhaust, I think it's starting to wear off. We'll stack it and pack it if we need to. What's that up there? Let's go have a peek. Drive time. I guess I'll put my belt on just in case we don't stop, but I think we're gonna stop. What is it? Is it metal? I think it's metal. Traffic coming. There's always that one dog. How you doing? Doing all right. Hey, took the park. Help me out a little bit. Mm. There you go. You want this? Thank you. It's still warm. Okay. Good stuff. I appreciate it. Take care. Hey guy, you don't mind if I put you on YouTube, do you? I left my nippers in the wagon.
guess I'll pick up the screw. Tougher. So we'll take them as they are. Scoops. I bet that's real stainless. And you guys said there wouldn't be nothing out here today. I gotta stop listening to you. Wow. That downspout's completely full of mud. So they won't take that for aluminum. Maybe breakage, but I doubt it, even at that. Like literally this whole thing is packed full of mud. Tread life. That might stay. Whatever. Forward. Look who it is. It's everybody's favorite scrapper. that fan until we walked over there to get some nippers cut its tail off huh. that actually came out easy enough I thought it was going to be buried in there my bad Well, we cut its tail off anyway. What do you think about that? Scoops. What's that? I don't know, but I think I'm going to put my gloves on. It's like half of a riding lawnmower. Or at least parts of one.
I'm gonna say that's the vast majority of it. No lie, man, it smells like some straight funk right here. <laughs> Maybe it's just your t-shirt laundry, Mr. Scrappity. <laughs> no, it ain't me, man. Somebody's cooking something besides turkey. Well, so far again, no sales today. It's all scrappy bits. Keep watching me deadlift this thing. Did you see that? <laughs> Power moves. Let's put a stretchy on it. I think we should put a stretching on it. I kind of feel like maybe we should. I'm thinking just maybe we should. Where are we going to put it though? Hmm. Let's do, do this little maneuver. Maybe that'll stay. Scoops. Leave that up, huh? They're the dollar store totes. They must not know about that roughneck quality. What's that? That's a mess, that's what that is. One of these days. Again, I've left my nippers in the truck. The truck, I mean the wagon. Huh. I don't see no trucks. You see any trucks? We don't see trucks, only wagons. Send that off to board sort. I'm just kidding. Uh, mystery bucket shopping basket score, possibly.
something heavy in it. That's it. I'm gonna head for the barn. Did you have fun? I had fun. We did better than I thought we would. That way. Supposed to get down into the 30s this weekend and into next week, 30s and 40s. That's pretty cool weather. And I don't have any gloves and I haven't got milk jugs taped to my steering wheel. That's because I don't ride a scooter. <laughs> For not riding scooters. You think there'll be a snowblower sitting on Scrappity's front porch when we pull in? I don't know. There might be, there might not be. Sometimes they show up, sometimes they don't. Let's find out. No snowblowers. Turn on the light, there we go. Okay, there was Thursday. I don't know, mostly scrappy bits. And we got all this. Hey, look, I got the motor off of that one. Um, took the motor out of there. That's a cast aluminum gimmicky thing there, but uh, I'm just gonna leave it. You ever seen a plastic dryer? Look at that. Whole thing was plastic. Well, the bottom of it. Uh, we got quite a few trinkets out of that. We cleaned all those microwaves up today. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. A whole lot of nothing. Uh, what do we got in here? We got some motors and some faucets and some brassy boys and bits to clean up. Maybe we'll do that tomorrow.